Hey guys, welcome back to Working Class Outdoors. Today we got a pretty cool video. We got a couple of firsts. Um, team member Jay Pope and our friend Bradley Humphrey, the owner of Hooks Creek Game Calls. He makes all of our turkey diaphragms. Um, they both got their first self-filmed bow kill on camera back a few weeks ago. I've been lazy, hadn't had time to get this video edited, so I decided to put them both together into one video because they both happened quickly. There wasn't much, really much footage. Um, I think Jay's hunt was probably less than 30 minutes uh, total, and Brad's was probably even less than that. They were both quick hunts. Hope you enjoy them. Give us a thumbs up if you like the video. Comment below. Subscribe to our channel. Remember, we're working for a living, living for the outdoors. Thank you for watching, and we appreciate you. All right. Today is Tuesday, September 25th. I'm down here in Montgomery County at Ravon's place. He's going to let me hunt one of his stands this evening. I uh, sure do appreciate that, Ravon. He knows how bad I want to shoot something, so um, he's putting me on a spot. It should, should have a doe show up. Um, you never know. It's a little warm today, so we're just hoping that something comes out so I can um, try to get a kill on video and um, redeem myself from that miss from this past Saturday or Sunday, whatever day it was. Anyway, um, got a little bit of a northeast wind this evening. Not much at all. Um, it's kind of still, honestly. It's hot. Um, it's September still, so just trying to get a few more um, hunts over corn before they go all the way to Akron's. It's um, they're transitioning right now. So, um, but according to him, he put some corn out here yesterday, and the corn was gone. So they must be hitting this spot still. So maybe something will show up between nine dark. I'm gonna get in there. <clears throat> Pretty early for me, it's 10 to 6, so um, I'll have plenty of time to get set up and whatnot. So we'll see y'all on the tree. been in the stand long and it's it's so tight in there before he knows it there's some does coming in on him he barely has time to get the camera on Finally, Jay um, draws his bow, but one of the does sees him moving and she's got him pegged. You see her start doing the foot stomp.
Looks like they're both a little spooky and they're trying to ease off, but Jay's got the bow drawn back and he's putting the bead on her shoulder. I don't see the arrow. The arrow might be in her. I'm going to get that watch shot. Get a good direction of which way she went. I was hoping to see blood at impact, and I don't. So, I have to watch it one more time. Be back in a minute. I watched it back. The shot looked good to me. If I can't find some blood. Well, after looking for a while, Jay couldn't find any blood. So where he's hunting, he's actually near a blood tracker and he called him up and he was there in just a few minutes and helped him get on the trail. So this is Semper. That's her, that's his name, her Semper name. Fi. Semper Fi. Semper Fi. Semper Fi. Always right. faithful. He does good. Got Mr. Jesse Hauser out here to help me track my doe that I shot this evening. That's it. <laughs> we'll see how you do. He's good though. He is good. Okay, Semper, come here, boy. Come here. Huh? He ain't running off. I enjoy tracking actually more than bow hunting. Bow hunting, I get more dog on excitement trying to dog on find mm -hmm. places. Semper? Down, boy. Okay. Right there's your blood. You got a spear right there. Hey! I did not, I did not see that. Oh, we got good blood. I bet it's Jerry ain't far at all, honestly. I was getting fun of that on first blood. I was on the wrong trail the whole time. Yeah, blood right there. I'm already glad I called you. There she is. That's it right there. Hey, it's about time. After five doggone tracks. All I finally, right. We finally got a doggone deer. Way to go, Semper Fi. Woo, 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 woo. Like a, nice day, nice day. It looks like a last, last year. I'm, I'm last wondering year. if the arrow's still in her. Right you see the arrow in her? She looks like a last year's deer, and that's the best doggone thing for you. It is. That's what it looks like. I actually held off to shoot, 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 shoot one of those. I passed up a big old doe. Yeah. Get that right there. Um, that dog on video, I swear I thought it went like right in there. I did too. A little bit high. Went in there, it shouldn't have come back out unless it hooked on something, you know what I mean? Could have been. It, door. it could it could be up inside of it, I don't know. Yeah. But at that dog on length, 
from right you. there to right there. That's a. I guess that's a possibility. Well, as you can see, Jay, if you heard in the video, Jay actually never got on the correct trail, so that's why he didn't find blood. As soon as they found blood, old Simplify went right to her. Jay got him a nice doe. All right, Jesse. Okay. I want to shake your hand on camera. We got one minute of battery life. Thank Regan. you very much, sir. And um, I'm, sure um, I'm going to get you paid here. Okay. And um, hopefully next time I call you, it'll be for old Mossy Horns. Well, that's that's the one that people hug, hug, hug me over. They get so doggone excited. Right. And they'll, they ain't gay. They just, they get so doggone happy, boy, I ain't. Gay. Yeah. Well, we hope you enjoy that first little quick video. Let's watch Brad's hunt. Well, Brad just got set up in the tree and it's no time before he hears the unmistakable sound of a deer walking in the leaves. Before Brad got in the stand, he freshened up his mineral lick and sprayed some extreme interest around a few trees uh, from Black Widow Deer Lures. And finally this doe steps out and she's smelling everywhere where Brad sprayed it.
Tennessee boy over in there. I'm 280 pounds. I don't know. I just, I don't do stuff like that by myself anymore. I hunt by myself all the time. Thankfully, no Ray Bond, no Double D. Dawson come over here and helped me hang this town about a month ago. And we put out a, an Amber King blob. And I just doctored it up with some Amber King. Yeah. Uh...
see what the old phone one looks like. Plowed right through on that eastern full metal jacket. Boneyard archery. Look this up, please. Blazer Vase. Don't tread on me. And Ravon's working class outdoor air wraps. Double on. A little high, but the angle was okay. I got the top of this long and centered the opposite side. Well, I hate it so dark. Trying to find the photo on that a lot. Film on this DSLR, it makes great video. And it's just it's what I had at the time to be able to use. So, uh, maybe we'll get some light here in a little bit. If I can get her out and get her back to the house. Stay tuned. Well, there you go. We're real happy for Brad and Jay getting their first um, self film kill on camera. It's pretty good stuff. It's not easy to do, especially in such tight quarters. The deer is right on you. They see any movement you do, you got to be extra careful. And just having that camera in the tree makes it that much harder, guys. Like we said before earlier, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. Comment below. Subscribe to our channel. And remember, we're working for a living at Living for the Outdoors. Thanks for watching. God bless you.